What's going on guys? Sophisticated here bringing another Fizz gameplay video. Today we're in the mid lane. Ooh, are they doing a cheeky little invade? Run, Jinx. Cheeky little invade by the enemy team. But yeah, we're in the mid lane today. We are up against a Rumble. He took Flash. Ignite is running Comet and Resolve secondary. Gonna be a really tough matchup. Rumble is very strong. Uh, as you guys already know, he's one of my picks as well. I think he does really well into Fizz. But even if we can't beat this guy 1v1, which is gonna be tough, especially considering they have a talent jungle who's Pretty much going to be very mobile and able to like influence the lane we will just look to play around our team because i think our team is a little bit better and like team comp wise so we'll just look to farm up and just capitalize on any errors that he actually makes i checked to make sure we are actually recording this time boys so we'll see what this guy does he should shove the wave in i think that's the you know i mean kind of the nature of the beast with this guy I think I'm going to take my W. So if he just walks into us, I can at least look for an auto W auto. It's not the greatest trade for us, but at least we trade back into him, right? We don't just let him burn us for free. Actually, he got mega chunked right there in that trade. We actually came out very far ahead in that trade, surprisingly enough. I want to bait out his Q. Perfect. Look at that, boys. We don't get hit by any of his Q, any of his Q there. He is going to have his level 2, so i got to be a bit careful here. Got to give him some respect. I like to just walk up and try to bait out his Q. Like that. And if he shoves us under the tower, that's fine. We'll just farm up with our W. Take the game nice and slow, boys. Because they do have a talent, so he is going to be pressuring multiple people early. Probably the Talia, too. I just have to play safe here. Like I said, once we get our level 3 is when we can look to trade with this guy a little bit more. Until then, we're just going to be playing a little safe here. Decent trade by us. Not great. He traded a little bit better into us because he had his shield. That is going to hurt. And I got to kind of give up the cannon minion there. Maybe bait that out. Man, he's almost killable. Just very dangerous because if Talon comes there or comes to the mid lane, I'm just screwed. And he's ticking up a pot as well. So I don't think it's really be, would be beneficial for me to look for a solo fight at all. I might even just get a little recall in here. We're only down three CS. I think as long as we avoid an early death, we're fine. And the health that he's at right now, I think he would be able to kill us. If I misplayed, so I'm just going to grab that Dark Seal and run back to the lane. I'll use my E just to get back to the lane faster. They don't get the kill there, but they do get a lot of pressure. So he is going to be up on us pretty heavily in XP and gold, but he doesn't have TP. So he's actually going to miss a little bit of uh, XP here under the right here. So that's good. And we mitigated like dying to him early right we made sure we weren't out on the map for a talent kill or him killing us early solo which is pretty good when it comes to the rumble matchup Ooh, talent's bot lane he probably gets a kill there Ooh, not paying attention and almost missed the cannon wow we get the kill there massive boys massive i have a big wave here so if this guy misplays and gets a little too cocky i might be able to look for him We'll see how he plays this or this little uh skirmish potentially. He's got bone plating, but we're gonna trade really well into him right there. We have the wave shoved right under. I think we just look for another little cheater recall here. I'll throw a ward right here too. I think that's pretty good. So we can actually grab that and an amp tome. Some sustain and amp tome, really big. We actually come out a little bit ahead of him. He is going to be level 6 before us. But, again, we're mitigating this potential kill threat by them. I think they just need to reset here. I don't know why Talia's going back into him right there. He's baiting our whole team. Like, we can't fight that. I'm pretty sure that guy's level 6. I can't help him either. That's just all on them. Yeah, hopefully he doesn't get a 1,000 kills down there. He does. Not much I can do. The team just kept fighting him for no reason. 
But that's all good, boys. Is he, was he level 6? He wasn't even level 6. That is a feels bad man. Their bot lane is low. Maybe I can look for a little play myself. I don't know. I think they're just going to reset. And I'm sure this is... Ooh, they don't. This is free. I wonder... Do they know I'm here? I think she's dead here. Alright, that's good. Get a little kill myself. And if this guy... Greedy back somewhere. I might be able to kill him too. We'll see. All right, not too bad. Not too bad at all. Get a decent little kill. I'm gonna come here. I don't think I can do anything against this Rumble, especially with our jungler being pressured in there. I can definitely look for a little trade on the him here. Just auto W him. Dip out here. This talent is getting pretty cocky. It's good for us. I'm just going to spam ping this guy missing, too. I have my ult. I think this guy is very killable with a uh, Talia gank. I'm going to look for E here. I would love to look for an ult play there, but I just don't think we have the damage solo. If I had Ignite, maybe I'd look for him. But I definitely think he's just much stronger than us right now. Make sure we grab that cannon. I might just get a reset in. I do have a decent amount of gold. And he's way stronger than me right now. Actually, I have ult up. If we get a little gank here. I just don't know what summoners he has. Oh, I have no E here. I'm kind of trolling, boys. I just got a reset here. Bad play by me. Actually, I can at least farm this wave here. Just defend this. Don't go in on him. Just defend. All right, we're back. Grab that. Some boots. We're looking pretty good. We just got to play slow. Like I said, just have to not give this Rumble a bunch of kills early. Our Poppy is uh, having some issues here. Great, like, knockback by this. Like, imagine if I was here. If she looks to make plays with me whenever I'm in the lane, like, this dude's very killable. Yeah, I think we can do this. Honestly, I could probably just kill this Rumble if he stays. Poppy. He's going to have to... Ooh, what? That doesn't land? That's actually insane. Ooh, this might be bad for me. Yeah, I just got to flash out of here, I think. I got ignited and ulted. All right. Gangplank killed him by himself. Dude, if Talia just came here instead of doing her blue buff, bro. Ugh, that's so tragic, man. Because Talon's in the wings right here for sure. Like, I can't do anything about that. If she gets a knockback, can you get a knockback? I can't walk into that bush. Yeah, it plays over. I want him to help me with the wave. She can just land a knockback onto this guy, too. Eh, it would have been a little bit better if she actually just went for him with that knockback, but it's fine. I mean, we might be able to just do dragon with our bot lane. I am very low. I can't do it. I think I'm just going to grab the fruits here and try to head back mid. Catch the wave. I think my team is fine. Talon's at grub, so I think I just soaked this wave here mid. I do. Th I think trading grubs there is super good for us. Grabbing the dragon. The Kimtech dragon, I think, is so much better than three grubs. Just going to clear this and then get a reset in myself. I can't get anything. I guess I can grab an amp tome. This guy is very strong. If he didn't get those two kills, we'd be so good in this lane right now. He does have a little bit of a tempo advantage over me, though, right now. This wave is shoving in, though. Grab a little drink of water, boys. All right. 
As you can see, I have the chat turned off as well, fellas. I'm just going to focus on on uh, playing the game. All I can do is just type or ping my teammates if they don't decide to listen. Not much I can do about that. I have my ult and ignite. We can go for him. If she has her R up, but I want him to push the wave in. I'm going to let him like push me in. She's wanting to look. She's looking for an R play in, but I think she should just like. Man, this guy's playing so safe. If it lands. Oh, it does land. Is she gonna look for him at all? I did not get an R play by her. She made it seem like she was gonna look for an R. Actually, she just killed. I think he kills both of us here. Nah, Talon kills me though. That sucks. I figured she was going to look for her R whenever I fished him, but she did not R, which is very weird to me. But I did get a shutdown on this guy, so all in all, not that bad. Just kind of sucks Talon was in the area. If he wasn't in the area there, we would have got out Scots free, and the trade would have actually been super worth. Talon is... Dude, this Talon has 96 farm. Yikes. Somehow, our Cassante is getting mega beat up up there, too. That's kind of crazy. James will go down there for sure. Oh, good flash by her. Wow. Well played. Cassante should be dead here for sure. I'm going to look for him. He has no flame spitter, so... Dude, if he didn't have bone plating, we would have just traded so hard into him. I can look for him here. I need him to... I think I'm just dead here. Do they ignite, actually? Oh, that sucks. Dude, I didn't think he had ignite up. I thought he used it for... I think she's just toast here. I thought he used that on the Talia. I think this is a brief play by her. Unless she gets me. A good stun by... If he what? Double kill for these guys. I think I sell this. Not the greatest, fellas. Definitely not the greatest. Jinx is fed, though. This guy is fed. <laughs> Definitely not uh, good for us. Yeah, I didn't think that that... And honestly, I figured Poppy was going to go in a lot sooner. She was sitting over here whenever I hard engaged on that guy. But it's all good. We'll scale, boys. I mean, they're definitely in a much better spot than we are. But... We have a very fed Jinx. We have a Cassante who can rock him, sock him. We'll just keep on trying to do what we can do. I want to look for this play here. I want to take this ward out. Eh, we get that. That's fine. I want to look for this guy. I have ult up. Unfortunately, I don't know if we can even beat this guy because he has just the Merc Treads alone gives him enough magic resist to deal with us. Oh, what is this? My Balea is kind of just chilling. Taking her buffs. Yeah, this guy hard smashes us right now. There's really not much we can do. I can't even step up to the wave either. I don't have sustain. And he'll just burn me down with his Qs. He is in a pretty good spot, and he knows it, too. He's got the wave in a great spot here. I'm just going to dodge that with my E. I have ult, so if he <laughs> keeps pushing, maybe we can look for something, but... Your team has destroyed her. I think he just all-ins her. Yeah, I can't even go for that. Not unless my team comes. Look for a fish on anyone, honestly. Actually, we killed this guy here. I think we can look. Um, we might still can look here. We just have to play it a little slow. Eh, I don't think we can anymore. I think the play is the play is made here. Oh, dude, I got CC'd by the Bard. If I didn't get stunned, we would have killed both of them. 
All in all, not the worst play, though. Jinx is getting strong. And I'm brawling, too. Just a little bit far behind from the lane phase. Wave looks good, though, I think. Kasante scaling up up there, farming pretty good. I do want to farm these dragons. If we can get some more dragons, it'd be pretty huge. Got a nice kill onto the rumble in that last fight. See, he's so it, it makes him so tanky with just this extra health and this magic resist. I think she's got to just be careful because this guy's coming. He just one shots her. I'm just gonna ping her. That's all I can do. Give her the heads up. Although if they misplay here, we can look for this. I have control ward here. We can look for this for sure. They're gonna overextend. We can fight this for sure. Yeah, this is a big, big play for us. She's excited too. Let's go for this guy. He's gonna run past the tower and die. Perfect, perfect, perfect. They should have that talent. I don't think they need me. Even better. Look at that, boys. Great plays. Yeah, these these guys are getting pretty cocky. They could steal this with the Kaisa, but I think if I come down with my E Q W through it, thank goodness <laughs> that was close. All right, I'm just going to head bot. I'll let my bot lane go mid. That was amazing. Ooh, Kasante with the solo kill top two. Amazing. Let's go, boys. All right, getting some solo gold and XP down here. God knows we need it. We are a little bit behind this rumble. Boys are going ham down there. I got to be a bit careful because Talon is going to be respawned, right? So Ian like this was absolutely dumb. But you know me, boys. We a little bit greedy. All right, Rumble's there. Shoving in a big wave right here, so their team is going to miss that. That golden XP. Not too bad. Man, nice. Perfect. Awesome. I was about to say, damn, man. It would have been nice to get this, that uh, little buy off, but we did get it off. I think they got to be careful. Rumble's going to come in. Tal yeah, they're just toast. That was a bad take by Talia or Talia. Big shutdowns. I don't even think we go for it. Yeah, that's just theirs. I think, yeah, just going for that was a bad play. Like, three of us weren't even on the map. And they had their whole team there on the map. I don't even want to go for that guy. She's got to be careful. Or she'll be next. And she's got a shutdown on her. I don't think I can match this guy. He is strong, man. He's got the hole breaker, too. I want her to look for it. Oh, she's not looking. That lands, we might be able to get him here. Oh, he's got freaking... Dude, if, Tal if Talia looked here instead of doing whatever she's doing there, we would have killed this guy for sure. Jinx got shut down, actually. That's pretty terrible. The whole team's dying over here, actually. Yeah, that's tragic, man. I even got... That sucks. Sante is fighting there. I don't even think I can stop this guy's push. He is so strong. He rushed a hole breaker. That's the first time I've ever seen he's going to be able to get that. Leah is really not doing super hot, is she? Come on, let's go. Two and six. An enemy has been slain. Um, that rumble is a problem. I can't E here because if Gangplank's in the bush there. I don't know if he used his ult in that last fight, but... Okay, Jinx getting a big shot down there. That's pretty huge. I'm still level 12. I'm equal with rumble and levels. That's good. I think as long as we keep on focusing the dragons, we should be fine. He's farming up a mountain soul is massive. I don't think we go for the Baron at all. That just sounds like a... I mean, Rumble is down. And Gangplank's bot, and maybe I can bait them to come in mid or something. Honestly, even if I die here trying to, you know, hard shove waves or something, is super worth it. Okay, I guess we just hard smack the Baron. Wow, that's kind of crazy. I didn't realize we were that strong. Yeah, we got to reset. 
right, not too bad. We are getting pretty strong. Just going to spam ping that for the boys because that would, if we get this dragon, it'll set us up for soul point. Mountain soul is so good into their team comp. Yeah, Jinx is for sure the win con here. One jump ahead of you. I think we need to go for this. I want to stall it out as long as possible, taking this, so that way, hopefully, this will be up for when we uh, do it, do the dragon. Wanna see a trick? This is a big wave right here. A lot of XP. Did they TP up top? They did TP up top. And Even if Cassante, wow, he one. wins that 2v1. Even if he dies there, it's super worth. So I'm getting a lot of pressure here. Jinx is going to, for sure, high, like get good pressure there as well. Yeah, the enemy's going to end up losing out a lot on that play. I'm going to get a tier 2 here, potentially. I think I just keep sitting here. All right, nice. And then we'll just rotate down here, get this uh, mountain dragon. We'll set us up for mountain soul. Sante's actually insanely strong right now. He's going to get knocked up, so he's not going to be able to stun me. Let's go. Big pick right there. Not too bad. We're going to run down here and grab one more wave, I think. We have Baron, so we can afford to do it. Plus, four people on our team are going to be pushing mid. So, we want to apply some pressure in other lanes as well. I don't even think I'm going to reset. Because my team's fighting mid. So, if they lose that fight, I want to be able to draw some people down. Or at least get this uh, tier 2. It's like 700 gold. A lot of gold. Yeah, Rumble's coming to answer me, but it's too late. I'll have this gold. That's 700 in my pocket. And we're going to shove a big wave into their tower. All around going pretty well this game, fellas. Pretty, pretty damn well. Grab that up. I think instead of going Lich Bane, I think we're just going to go straight into Death Cap. Just because we have a good, like, buy, right? We have 1,200 gold. So instead of just grabbing a component for Lich Bane and then being item locked with the Dorans, we just go ahead and grab that needlessly large raw, giving us 70 raw AP. And then when I get enough gold, I'll sell this, grab another one. And we'll be real strong. I'm just going to group up with the team. We have Rift Herald. Oh, we don't. They have Rift Herald. But I'm just going to facilitate this Jinx. She's so incredibly fed. This guy should be coming down here with us. There's no reason for him to grab that Scuttle. <laughs> scuttle is not of any importance. We just got to be careful here. We'll look for a fish. Just to kind of disengage more so than anything. I see Talon in the wings right here. I don't know where he went. All right, he's on his blue buff. Might be able to just kind of steal it from him, maybe? Nah. Not really a whole lot we can do here. I don't have my ult. Well, he gets a... Wow, that is some damage by this Cassante, man. I might kill this guy. Yeah, I get him. I think I'm fine here with Zonya's this. Then I just double E out here. A big, big boys. Kill their jungler. It's going to help us get a little bit of pressure here. I have ult in 11 as well. We can't really siege this that well, though, without putting ourselves in too much danger. I don't have Lich Bane, so I not like I have a whole lot of damage. Big fish right there. I can maybe get something here, too. He gets to knock up onto this guy. Bring him here. Bring him to me. Bring him to me. I might die for this. I'm definitely going to die for this. Oh, so close. Oh, so close. Hey, we take those. Let's go. We got the assist there. We'll go ahead and sell this. Grab the needlessly large rod, boys. Pretty strong right here. Once we get this Rabadons, whoo, we are going to turn on. We are going to turn on. Not too bad. We're actually a level up on this guy now. 20 CS. 
weather the storm early, just like we said, fellas. Rumble's definitely a lot stronger early game, and he does really well, like, if he has a good team, and they do have a Wombo if they, like, ever, you know, Rumble ult on top of a Gangplank ult or something. But I think our team comp is just so much better. We have Talia for the anti, like, dive on the, ta the Talon. Then we have uh, Cassante, who's just a, a really nice front line. Also has a lot of damage, as you can see. And then Poppy. This Poppy's playing Phenomenally as well. Really facilitating the Jinx and myself. The only thing is, if we go for this Baron and they somehow, like, either kill us, wipe us, or get it themselves, it'd be real bad for us. See if we can't come catch this guy. Because if we get a pick onto the Bard, it'd be pretty huge. I'll look for a fish on. Oh, he knocked him out of my fish. But he's dead anyways. That's just going to bring us right into the Baron. I think we need to go for this guy. All right, we took out their vision here. This guy's going to drop an ult. Nice, we got the Baron. I'm fine with taking a little bit of damage there. I'm watching the Talon. He might be going for me. All right, I'm just going to reset, and I'll come answer this guy's push. He's got Hole Breaker, so... He actually will be doing a lot of damage here. I might need some help with him here, actually. Yeah, with Poppy, we should be able to kill him here. I'm going to Zonya just to stay healthy. I'll flash on him. I don't care. Killing him helps us siege their base, so... Big worth to me. Honestly, we should just be able to end unless they somehow kill us. We are 3v4 there. Yeah. Man, look at this. Well played by my team. I want to give a big shout out to my team. Instead of just running it down the mid, trying to end there, we're actually going for the Dragon Soul. So big, especially off of the back of like Gangplank being de dead too. Just makes so much more sense to do this. Talon is alive. Could look for a pick here. Nice. We still get it, and we kill the Talon too. With Mountain Soul, we might just be able to end the game here. No, if we can keep going though. I'm gonna reset here. I have Death Cap. It's a big, big buy. I know we're all kind of running it down right there, but that's just too big of a buy. I think we need to go here and here. I don't think we can end even with... Yeah, I think we just need to come here and here. I mean, maybe we can end. It just doesn't make any sense, honestly. They have four people. We have a huge wave right here that we could look double cannon, triple cannon wave here. I'm pinging it. Hopefully, my team will see because this is a massive wave buffed by the like Baron. It's like incredible power here. All right, there's the ult onto the Jinx. She might go down there. Talon's onto her. I'm just going to keep pushing. There's no point in me rotating over there at this point. Nice. I think we just went off of that. Rumble's pretty much all their strength. Yeah, this is GG, fellas. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. All right, fellas, there it is. Fizz mid versus Rumble. The double flex. Take the after action after this. All right, fellas, this is the after action for the game we just played against that Rumble mid. And yeah, this was a pretty good game. We weathered the storm early. We had a little bit of a mishap. Um, I feel like we played the very early lane against him pretty well. Um, there probably was a very slight like margin to solo kill him early if I would have pushed the limit like to the utmost limits. Uh, but I think it's just better to try and weather the storm because it, it, here's the thing. If I do get far behind him early in the lane, like he just dominates. There's no chance at like coming back, especially when he takes resolve secondary with bone plating. Like if he didn't have the bone plating, there was multiple trades where we would have just killed the guy. Um, so yeah, if, if, you know, I mean, I do think with the bone plating, the better option is to just try and survive the early lane and look for ganks from your jungle, like look for skirmishes, 2v2, um, wait till you get your level six, alt them, and then try to make plays around your team. And yeah, that's pretty much what we did. We didn't ever really look to 1v1 him. Um, we pretty much only fought him whenever like we had a, a support roam or Talia came mid. Or if he looked to fight like our team in the jungle, skirmishing with his jungler or his bot lane. And then, yeah, basically we just roamed around with our, our team, you know, roamed around with Talia. We had a couple really good like 
counter ganks where the Rumble and the Talon would go bot lane or the Rumble and Talon would invade the Talia and then we would go back on the back half of that fight and skirmish and win. Um, but yeah, all in all, very, very good game. Our whole team played out of their minds. Everyone played really well. Even Talia, at one point, I think she was like two and six. And so she really brought this back. Um, she played a phenomenal jungle though, to be honest. And yeah, my you know big shout out to the Jinx and the Poppy. Hard dominating their lane, completely smashing it. Jinx, you know, we're, as you can see, we're playing with diamond players now at this point, boys. So we are getting very close to that diamond four. Uh, we're already in the MMR, but we're getting close to it ourselves. We got 22 LP from that. So we are sitting at a comfortable 27 LP, which means we can lose two games um, in a row and still not demote. But yeah, we're not going to do that. We are going to be on a little bit of a roll. We're honestly on a roll right now. Um, let's see. Take a look at the ranked queue here. I think, yeah, out of our last six games, we're five and one. So not bad at all. Um, we are at our peak this season. Hopefully we can hit diamond. We still have a good amount of time. What we have like, uh, what is it? The 24th. So we still have 20 days, which is pretty nice. And it, I think, I think it's very achievable as long as I just keep playing with, <laughs> keep playing with the chat off and just focus in on the game and try not to be so hard on myself about the game as well and just try to have fun with it honestly while also like trying to improve as a player um, hold myself accountable for my own mistakes stuff like this um, but yeah fellas if you enjoyed that video drop a like if you're enjoying the content hit that subscribe button it really does help to push our content out to uh, new people helps us grow the community and get discovered and uh, yeah stick around for the next video